Craig, you mentioned last week that kickoff return was an emphasis. Again, a lot of starts inside the 20, inside the 15. What's, what's got to change there? Yeah, you know, uh, again, it's a big emphasis for us this week. we got to continue just to harp on the details of what we're trying to get accomplished, um, whether it's the returner, whether it's our blocking schemes. Uh, and that's something that we've really talked about a lot, you know, in our meetings. So we'll continue to work on it all week, and uh, hopefully we can get this thing going. Just as simple as you're not blocking it well enough? Uh, it, it could be a little bit of everything, whether we're not getting our double team blocks, whether we're having the wrong leverage on one key block. Uh, so I, I, it's not really one thing. It's, uh, you know, it's just things here and there that we just need to clean up. So uh, today will be a big emphasis on it, and we'll try to continue to work with the guys, and we'll try to coach it better, and hopefully we can, again, get it going. Reports that you guys have signed uh, Johnny Townsend, Hunter. Uh, yep. Are you concerned? You know, are you expecting Brett to not be available Sunday? Well, I think we're just going to go day by day with that, um, with Brett. And obviously, we wanted to bring some punters in to work out um, and just see what's going on. And uh, obviously, Johnny had a good workout for us today. So we'll end up um, you know, seeing what he can do and see how Brett progresses throughout the week been signed then? I guess that's what the report said. I, I, I'm not sure yet with that. Um, I think you could probably ask Vrabel or Jay Rob with that, but uh, he came and worked out and, and did a good job for us. Um, how much like about uh, what you see maybe in the return game from um, how Chester's done and maybe where is that kind of uh, flipped for you? Yeah, you know, I, I think our guys are really excited to go out there and block for Chester because here's a guy who's fearless who's going to catch the ball and he's going to run and get vertical and make some guys miss in space. And I, I think our guys, you know, really follow that and see, you know, he's given an all he's got and uh, our guys want to go out there and block for him. And, and third down, you see guys really huddling up close to Matt and myself and wanting to get out there and block for him. So, you know, Chester's brought a little confidence back there to that return unit and our guys are feeding off of that. If I'm not mistaken, McNichols got a couple of kick returns, is he, correct? He did. What, what was, was it just like to get a different look? Or? Yeah, I, I think, you know, going back into it and what, what was asked earlier is, uh, you know, we're, we're starting inside the 20 on some kickoff returns and, you know, Chester's taking some shots back there and we, we wanted to give Jeremy a chance uh, to go back there and, you know, break a tackle here and there if he can. Uh, but we just wanted to see what he could do also. And uh, again, he'll get the chance this week too. If you, if you do end up bringing in a new punter, how, how um, you know, much of a change is that? How, much, how hard is that to get used to in a week? You know, what, what a different punter does, I guess. Yeah, you know, I, I think even going on last, last year, what happened with that, with Brett being hurt, um, you know, it is difficult for a guy to come in, but, you know, most of the guys are professional. They'll come in there, they'll punt. We'll try to get them as many reps as we possibly can, not only in punting, but he also has to hold. Uh, so that's going to be a big thing for us today, tomorrow. Uh, you know, if Johnny comes in there, we're going to ask him to do all that stuff. So we're going to have to get in there and grind it out and work with him on a lot of different things. What is uh, Townsend? What are his strengths, maybe, from what you've seen or from the workout? Yeah, you know, I, I think he strikes the ball really well. Um, good directional punter, uh, you know, has a good get off. So those are the things that you're looking for with a guy with good leg strength and, uh, you know, a guy who can place the ball where we want it to. Um, you know, some teams ask a guy to bang the ball middle of the field. Some of them ask to, to directional kick it outside the numbers. So we'll continue to work with him and see what he's capable of doing. Um, but we thought he hit the ball well today, and, and um, we'll see what he can do the rest of the week. What, um, what, what, when you watch the Jets, what are some of the things that maybe jump off the tape that you guys be concerned with? Yeah, you know, one of the major things is they, they've got a really good core player in 34 Hardy. Uh, this guy's all over the field. He plays relentless, good player. Uh, really enjoy watching him play, um, going and making tackles, and they got a uh, good group of core players. You know, last week, 43 got his hands, Phillips got his hands on the ball versus Denver. Uh, so we've, we've got to be ready. We've got to understand what their skill sets are, and we've got to be able to handle those guys.